Hi everyone, my name is Leah and welcome to the kitchen. One thing I really want to say is that I love eating pizza and I also like baking with beer. So in today's video, we're going to be making a homemade beer pizza dough. Let's get started. For this recipe, you need some flour, sugar, olive oil, a light colored beer such as an IPA, a Pilsner, or an ale, some instant yeast, salt, and some water. Begin by measuring four and a half teaspoons of yeast into a mixing bowl. I happen to be using instant yeast, so it does not require the extra proofing time like standard active dry yeast. However, if using active dry yeast, be sure to proof your yeast first. Earlier in the COVID pandemic, I actually could not find any kind of yeast anywhere. But then I found this instant yeast and it has worked perfectly ever since. Next, add in two teaspoons of sugar and then a half cup of warm water. Pour two and a half cups of beer into a measuring cup. Make sure you allow the foam to settle so you measure the full amount. Add in two tablespoons of olive oil. One teaspoon of salt. And two cups of flour to the mixer. Begin mixing using the dough hook attachment. Add in two more cups of flour and mix again. Gradually pour in the pre-measured beer to the running mixer. Continue adding in two more cups of flour, a half cup at a time, mixing well after each addition. Depending on how sticky the dough is, you'll need to add another cup or two of flour. When the dough starts to come together and pull away from the sides of the bowl, allow the mixer to knead for five minutes. Grease a large bowl with some cooking spray and transfer the dough to the greased bowl. Cover the bowl with a damp towel or some plastic wrap and allow to rise for one hour. Punch the dough down and break into three smaller pieces. Now that we've made this beer pizza dough, we divided it up into three different pieces. And if we can use this dough to roll it out and make some pizza, or we can make little dough balls and surround some spinach and artichoke dip. The possibilities are endless. The link to this recipe can be found in the description box below. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more delicious recipes.